Oh yeah, buddy, Sir Stillwater. Okay, in this video, I'm going to go ahead and pick up where I left off. I'm going to, um, real quick, I'm going to go ahead and pick up the guy here. Oh yeah, I'm showing military buildings, so I'll tell you this. Uh, we're in this development tree. I think it's probably video five, video six, I'm not sure. Um, it'll be obviously be in the description. It'll also be in the playlist. Um, if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. Um, or, uh, you know, comments, uh, like it. I really appreciate that. Whatever. You know the deal. Okay, so back to the back to the task at hand. So I'm going to go and click on my building that I've been working on. I'll go ahead and train my fourth troop. You notice that you can unlock another one, but that costs you diamonds. You notice common theme in diamonds. Diamonds cost money. Diamonds can be used everywhere. Diamonds are your friend uh, to advance the game quicker. If that's your if that's your thing. So um, I've had no affiliation with the game um, outside of I've just been playing it for years. I'm. I'm a I'm a free player that has paid, and that's just you know whatever. It's a game that I like. It's a game that I've I played and taken breaks from, and came back and played again over the years. And it's just it's a cool game. So it is what it is. Okay, so now I'm going to go ahead and click on the uh, other spear fighter. You notice he's uh, this uh, barracks has the last two aren't unlocked yet. I'm going to go ahead and unlock them. And oh look, I can't unlock this one because I don't have enough supplies. See, it's in red. So either way. Training cost is always the same for all the troops. Once they're unlocked, it just costs you a little more to unlock them. Train him. Okay, good. So now, while that's doing its thing, I'm going to harvest these. I'm going to jump around here. If I'm going too fast, just let me know in the comments, and I'll try to slow it down, or if I'm getting too far, too wide on my topics, um, same thing. Please give me your feedback, because that will really help influence uh, future videos and making a better video for you, so uh, you have something you can enjoy or something that uh, you can use as a, uh, a learning tool. So... Troops. So I'm going to go over here. Army management. That's what it's called. Uh, they have a quick key for it. It's a U. I haven't. I never use quick keys, but it's there. Uh, Army management. That's a little like helmet thing. And you see my troops. You can have troops like in the bank or whatever you want to call that. Um, or you can add them up top. And these are the ones that will battle if you're in a position where you can battle against somebody. Which we'll go to the continent map in just a minute and do that. So uh, let's go ahead and pick up this guy. This one's all, I'm fully trained here, so unless I want to spend some coin, or spend some diamond, excuse me, um, I'm not, I never unlock my fifth because I don't play diamonds. So if I do, I use them for other things, the free ones you get in the game. So, and then I can't unlock this, so I can just keep training the three in here, the four in there, plus the two they gave you to begin with, that once they die, you can retrain your own, but the ones you got for free, when they die, they're gone. So just heads up. Okay, so that's doing its thing. I go to storyline. I did build my spear fighter barracks. I get my 200 supplies. I collect. That's awesome. Um, now I can recruit a spear fighter. Um, these, because I've already recruited them, I have to do it after I open the quest in order for that, or the storyline, in order for that to, to work. So near, now I recruit him. So I click him, and it should say, yay, look, I completed it. So I come in here, and now it's going to give me 200 coin. That's awesome. Okay have two memorials, which I already do because they're already built, and they make people enthusiastic. They have the big grinning smile up here, so we're good. Collect those. That's a nice thing is some of these early ones, you could really kind of run right through these and uh, gain resources that really helps you early in the game. And I'll train my last guy. You notice I've, now I got my coin from that. I can go and unlock that and train. And now I need to build, what do I need to build? I needed to build another stilt house. So click here and I go to the house. And I want to say stilt house. Oop, oh crap, I don't have enough, I don't have enough coin because I just spent it all. Enough supplies, I mean, because uh, I spent them all. So now I gotta wait for my supplies to to come back in. So oops. That little mismanagement on my part. Got a little got a little anxious on unlocking troops. So either way, uh, come in here. You notice it does cost to train too. It's gonna cost me 25 and 25. Early in the game, that's gonna be uh, that's gonna be a pinch point. You're gonna have these little pinch points all over the place. Um, do you build, do you train, do you unlock, do you, whatever you do, I click these, I come in here, I'm just going to start grinding in five minutes, I'll kind of do it in the back of this video narration, if you will, okay, so, back to what we're talking about, um, now I want to go ahead and say, what are my opportunities to get some coin, because I'm pretty low on coin right now, uh, do I have enough to build a stilt house, no, I don't, I need 150, but I know, because I remember on our continent map, click him, on the continent map, I have an opportunity to unlock two other, or, or conquer two other areas in here 
that pay some type of reward. Here, this one pays 60 supplies, and that one pays 65. So I'll go ahead and click on the 60. Here's three guys here. I'm going to go ahead and attack. I'm not going to talk about infiltrate right now. But I'm going to go and do an attack. I'm going to load up my army bar. I'm going to go eight against three. Hopefully we'll win. We'll talk about military stuff later. Personally, uh, early in the game, just use auto. I prefer auto battles. You can do your own thing. Attack manually. You probably should. Be good practice. But uh, I'm just going to do auto battle. It does it. it tells my results. I, these three guys are uh, defeated. My one guy uh, took a little bit of a beating. Um, this guy a little bit. And then they then they heal themselves. But either way, yay. So I got that open. Or uh, say okay. And then I just picked up my 60. You know, now I'm at 160. And I might as well hit the last one. And then I will do attack. And I'm going to take the guy that's kind of wounded and bring up somebody that's fresh. And this one here is minus one. If you can, always use fully uh, fully healthy troops up here because um, you're only disadvantaging yourself if you don't. If you've got them and you're not using them. Um, auto battle. Bam. Same deal. I'll say okay. And that was worth 65. Now I'm at 225. Congratulations. I acquired the sector. This is where I was starting before it kind of took me down that other path. So now I go back to the overview. And now look, I've got now I've got two that I can unlock. This one costs 10 silver, which is like, I mean, 10 coin, which is basically nothing. And that was 20. You know, there's different time durations, mouse over. Um, actually, it doesn't even tell you how long it's going to take until you click on it, I think. So I click on it, and it tells me it's going to take seven minutes. It cost me cost me the coin. I go back. Okay, good. Now I can go build my stilt house. Thumbs up. Go over here. How am I doing on time? Boy, I'm past time again. I'm trying to keep these around five, six, seven minutes tops. So I'll go ahead and I'll build a stilt house. Placed it. With the quest. Yay, look. I just hit that quest because I built my second stilt house. I collect 300 more supplies. So see how you can really gain a lot of supply and a lot of coin early in these early quests. I mean, 200s, 300s, that's a lot of production time uh, that you'd have to collect from to get that many coins and uh, supplies. So these early quests are helpful for that. So I go and collect. Oh, I researched something I already did and have a pottery. I've already built one. So you see, I'm kind of doing a catch up. So all of a sudden, and then buy a forge point. We'll talk about that next video. So look, that really shot these numbers up. So now I can go ahead and I can build out a bunch of stuff. So I'm going to cut it here. If you have any questions, comments, or suggestions, please leave them below. Um, let me know what you think. I'm, I'm really, really, really interested because that helps uh, make, um, make better videos in the future. So if you like things or if you don't like things, if I talk too fast, if I uh, don't talk enough, <laughs> which I can hardly believe that, um, or if the videos are getting too long, too short, whatever, please leave the comments below. Uh, it really helps me understand how I can make things better um, for you, the viewer, of our videos. So thanks. Take care. Bye.